<sighs> well guys, just finished fixing everything. It took me half an hour, about. So, yeah, I bet you're happy I cut that out and didn't make you watch it. Okay. Well, today we are going to be starting Botanica. And, yeah, and I lost a lot of stuff. Like, I lost, I just stuff I know about is the melon and pumpkin seeds. Don't have those anymore. So what we're going to do today is wait, how many do we have? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. Okay, so we have one of each, or at least one of each, but we need more. So today, guess what we're going to do? Oh, I should probably bring my backpack, but we are going to, for a second time, go exploring and find stuff because I don't want to be around this house right now because I'm worried I'm just going to break it. So... I'm just going to wander, and I'll probably put this in like a speedy kind of sped up thing so it's not going to take hours, but I will speed it up and I'll put some cool music on. So you guys just sit back, relax, and enjoy. Adios!
Well, we died again, so um, I don't know how to do this. I think I'm just going to wait the blood moon out, and we'll get our stuff in the morning. Okay, well, yeah. Okay. Well, the blood moon has ended, so we are going to go and recollect all of our stuff that was left. Okay, now there's a zombie in our house. Let's run upstairs. Mm, options. I turned the sound off too. It got annoying. Okay. Go away. And we should have a. Dang it, I moved the sword. Okay, we're gonna have to beat this zombie to death. Actually, no, what I can do is run up. Hey, oh, look at all of this. This isn't fair. Kill all these zombies. Die, little zombie sprite or whatever they're called. Okay. Okay, no. We're not having another creeper blow this place up. We're gonna kill this one. Oh my god, they're gonna break the door down. This is insane. Okay, let's go ahead. Oh, I hate this. There are monsters everywhere. This is awful. Okay, well. I'm gonna run. Oh my god, there's so many monsters. I do not like primitive mobs at all. It is my least favorite mod of all time. I hate it so much. It's so much worse than when you first start playing Minecraft and you have no idea how to do it and you die in lava trying to get diamonds because you dig straight down, but this is worse. What the heck? Well, what book did I get? Power 4. It's pretty, pretty, it's really good. I'm not going to complain anymore. But still, I mean, blood moons, 
insane mobs. My house base is now completely overrun. There's no way that I'm going to be able to get that back without a creeper blowing up. It's insane. It's so aggravating because I spent so much time working on that house and then it's just, it's been blown up time after time. Not by traditional Minecraft creepers because those aren't an issue, but the stupid primitive mobs one. It's so dumb. And now I have to go get myself because I was murdered by a blood moon. Oh, and I'm sorry about the um gray footage. I was going to record that, but then it said the blood moon was rising and I got really, really scared. And so I just smacked my grave. I didn't sit time because I kind of took a little bit of like a break in the recording because it took me about half of an hour to dig up the footage and start finding out where everything was. So that's why that happened. But it's insane. I mean, how are you supposed to deal with that stuff if you don't have any like really good tools and armor? And I had pretty decent tools and armor. I had a diamond sword and full arm and armor iron armor i mean i know it's not enchanted or anything but still you think it could be a little bit better or a little bit easier to defend yourself okay and i don't know where i died so i'm probably gonna have to dig up the footage again and find out where i died because i had to spend half an hour sitting in my house doing nothing actually it's right there but still how is someone who's spent probably at this point like two, two and a half hours playing supposed to be able to not die when stuff like that happens? It's insane. Like there's no way that you would be able to do that. Even if you did have like com a complete set of iron armor and just all of this stuff. That you're not, or not a complete set of iron armor. But if you didn't have a complete set of iron armor, you'd die within seconds. You'd go outside and you'd just explode. Literally, you'd just go outside and a thousand creepers would just murder you. But now, instead of creepers murdering us, we're going to have to go back and deal with the primitive mobs creepers, which are going to blow up our house again. I don't even know where to start with getting them away from the house. I'm sorry this has been such a chopped up episode, but I mean, I haven't really had a choice. <laughs> okay, let's just go back and the creepers shall blow up what they wish. I will do my best. Um, I'm sorry that I've been so unproductive this session. It just seems like everything I've done has been blown up or been sabotaged in one way or another. But maybe once we get back and I dump all of my mystical flowers in our botanica chest, it'll all be worth it. Because then I'll at least be able to say, I finished the compound and I collected flowers for botanica. So next, sex next session, when I start with botanica, I'll be able just to start with botanica and no more crap and all of this awful stuff will happen anymore. Or at least I hope. Because now, when they're blood moves, I'm going to barricade my door, because the zombies nearly broke down my door, and I'm going to just not even try. I'm going to sit there and wait until the blood moon is gone. Because that seems like the easiest way to deal with them to me. Because it's impossible. I, I could have barricaded myself in a hole, yes, but there's no way to be out when there is a blood moon. Chameleons, I wanted one of you, but I lost my melon seeds to a stupid primitive mobs creeper. Do you drop anything? No. I'm sorry I killed you. I just wanted to know. They're so cute. Hello, chameleon. So, that's the only thing I like about the primitive mobs mod. The stupid chameleons. And they're not even that cool. I mean, other mobs, other mods have done similar stuff. So, really, the primitive mobs mod could just go and never come back, and I wouldn't care. I really would not care. I would learn how to live without it. So many flowers now. If I don't have enough after this, I'm going to be really surprised, because it seems like all I've done for the past hour has been <laughs> collecting flowers. And that's not, like, actually all I've done, but... See, that's why I've been splicing this up, because I've spent the span of an hour probably in this 18 20 minute episode so yeah it's been a long time for me getting irritated okay let's go ahead and murder these last couple chickens i see the base over there maybe the mobs will have despawned 
if I like run away like that, maybe the, the computer will be nice and get rid of them for us. But I seriously doubt that's going to be the case. I think that I'm going to get back, everything's going to blow up. I already managed to kill a few of the zombies. I was pretty resourceful with all the um, like climbing up and down ladders and trapping zombies in the basement. I don't know, I thought that was pretty good. Okay, but still, that's just insane how much they expect you to do with so little gear like this is a hard pack it is not one of those packs where you can just join on a server and start playing like if i had started if i start this from scratch ever again for some unknown reason which i will never do because i don't want to have to go through this again i'm not going to waste as much time building a base i didn't waste time but like i'm going to be much more efficient i'm not going to look for a nice biome i'm just going to build a base wherever i spawn okay so what is there around? Just go away. I hate you. Okay, so it looks like that did work. I'm like leaving got all the mobs to despawn. Oh my god, that's insane. Okay, let's just fix the balcony for the third time. And let's come down to the botanica chest. I don't even have enough space. Do I have a chest that I can use to put armor and gear in? Because we're going to have to, like, resort all this stuff. Yeah, we, here, we can put, like, an armor and foods chest. We can put, like, survival gear. Okay. Survival gear. My spelling processes are very strange. Don't judge me. Okay, we'll have all of that stuff go in there. And then we'll take our diamond shovel. And now we'll take all of this armory stuff and those arrows. I think there are more arrows. Oh, that's my backpack, not the chest. Oh, there are the arrows. I was like, why did I make this chest so awful? Here, there's food there. That counts as, like, completed food. All of this other stuff is just going to go in a chest somewhere. Okay, let's just dump all of this stuff into my inventory. Okay, seeds go in this chest. Cotton seeds can go in this chest. I don't have any other seeds. We did get some blaze powder, however, from murdering all of those mobs, so that was worth it. I think it was one of the creepers I killed. He gave me some blaze powder when I severed his head from his body, because that is how I feel about creepers now. I hate them with a fiery passion. Mystical, 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 mystical. I don't see any other mystical ones. Let's go ahead and put the barley seeds in there. I'm going to rip the head off of that slime. Okay, and I have a good amount of all the flowers except the mist. Oh, no, never mind. Yeah, I have a good amount of flowers now. I'm going to start with Botanica next session. Oh, this has been so awful. I mean, it started with that stupid creeper that blew up our stuff. And all that happened since then is it just escalated and escalated and escalated until I nearly had a heart attack, because it's been so stressful. <laughs> okay, let's go ahead and dump all of that stuff in there. We have lots of stuff that can go into the fossils on archaeology mob. I'm very tempted to never leave my home again, like at this point. Um, I'm very tempted just to never leave, and everyone can fend for themselves. Merry Christmas, Happy Hanukkah, and I will see you never. Okay, and let's go ahead and put the raw beef, and then, no, the raw chicken.